Hey everybody, Ryan here at eTrailer. Today on our 2020 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited, we're gonna be taking a look at the Blue Ox Avail tow bar. So there's gonna be a total of five main components needed to flat tow your Jeep down the road. First one's going to be your base plate. The base plate's going to provide us with a solid and reliable connection point. That way we have something to hook up our tow bar to. The tow bar is going to be that second component. That's actually going to be the link that hooks up to your base plate to the back of your motorhome, and this is actually going to physically pull your Jeep down the road. The third component is going to be safety cables. So safety cables are pretty straightforward. They're there in the event of a accidental disconnect. The safety cables are gonna keep your Jeep and motorhome connected together. The fourth component is going to be your tow bar wiring. So the tow bar wiring is going to transfer the lighting signals from the back of your motorhome to the back of your Jeep, and that's going to help keep you safe and legal. The fifth component is going to be a braking system. So the braking system is going to apply the brake pedal inside the Jeep whenever you hit the brakes in your motorhome. That's going to not only reduce the wear and tear on your motorhome's braking system, but it's also going to make your stops more safe and predictable since the Jeep's applying its brake pedal on its own and not relying on the motorhome to do all the work. When it comes to tow bars, there really is a lot of different options to choose from. Now, I personally like this one because it really offers all those features that really matter and make it easy to use. So first and foremost is the fact that this tow bar is non-binding. So more or less what that means, just to kind of give you an example and paint that picture, is say you're flat towing your Jeep, you arrive to your destination or your campsite, nine times out of 10, you're not on perfectly level ground. And so when you're pulling the Jeep behind your motorhome, your arms are locked into position. That way it'll give you a nice, predictable ride as you're going down the road. But you go to unhook it and you really don't have any wiggle room here. Other tow bars can be extremely difficult to pull the pins out and release them and get everything disconnected. Well, if the tow bar is in a bind when you get to your destination, this one's gonna be really easy. You're gonna have these handles here that you simply just push down on that's going to release the tension in the arms and make it super easy to pull your pens out and get unhooked. One of the things that really sets this tow bar apart as well is that it's going to last a long time. And that's really due to the fact that we have these rubber covers here. So underneath the cover is where your arm is going to slide in and out as you make turns and etc. Some of the other tow bars don't have these covers, so those arms are exposed. Well, over time, going down gravel roads, driving in the rain, things of that nature, that dirt, moisture, water, debris, whatever it may be, can accumulate on the arms. And as they go in and out, they can actually push inside of the tow bar, damaging the seals and making it extremely difficult for those arms to pull in and out in the future. With this one, we're sealed and covered, and that's something we're not gonna have to worry about. And one of the things too that's really not always thought of until it's too late is how your vehicle is actually going to be pulled behind your motorhome. And the tow bar is going to have a lot to do with that. This one, your Jeep is going to track nicely behind the motorhome for a few different reasons. This tow bar is nice and long and so it does put a little bit of distance in between our two vehicles. And since the arms are protected and covered and go in and out nice and smooth, Whenever you go to make turns, you're not gonna have to worry about anything binding up or not having enough distance. And that can really be nerve wracking sometimes, especially with those big motorhomes. And a Jeep is a relatively large vehicle. That's something you're really not gonna have to sweat. You're gonna know you have enough distance here and that the tow bar is going to function properly. That way you're not gonna have to worry about it. The tow bar is going to have a 10,000 pound maximum weight capacity which is obviously more than enough for our Jeep. But for me, that weight capacity would give me the peace of mind knowing that we're really heavy duty and we're not even close to our limit. Plus, if you ever do end up, say, getting a larger pickup truck or something like that, that you do want a flat tow, you know, with this tow bar, you're still gonna be covered. You're not gonna have to worry about picking up another one or upgrading. It's also gonna come with safety cables. So that's gonna be one less component that you're not gonna have to worry about picking up separately. Now the tow bar is going to be versatile too. It's gonna to work with a lot of different things. So for example, it's gonna work with Kurt base plates as well as Blue Ox base plates. 
Now, if you have a different brand of base plate, chances are really good that there's an adapter available that you can put on the end of the tow bar to be able to pair the two together. And you can find those here at eTrailer. In our case today, we have a Kurt base plate, and the way the tow bar hooks up is super easy, really not much to it at all. You'd simply line up the three lugs with your base plate, take your pen, slide it through, and put the keeper pen on the other side. And whenever you do get to your destination and you unhook your Jeep, this can be easily stored on the back of your motorhome. That way you don't have to take everything completely apart. So the way it works is you just fold it up and then just push it down to one side. Pretty convenient. That way when you go to hook back up, everything's right here. Now this can be permanently stored on the back of your motorhome. And I would recommend picking up a cover that goes over it just to help keep it out of the weather. And I would also recommend picking up a locking hitch pin. That way the tow bar is secured and it ain't coming off unless you have the key. And that'll finish up our look at of the Blue Ox Avail tow bar on our 2020 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited.